Welcome. Today I will show you how you can enable or change your refresh rate on the headset. So to get started, we're going to open up our settings. Where is it? Right over here. And we're going to navigate to system. And from here, we have two ways we can go into power. And by enabling the extended battery mode, this will actually enable 75 Hertz uh, straight away and also prever preserve a little bit of battery life. So that's a way that you can change the refresh rate, but there is also another one that just allows you to choose it under the display, as you can see. So we have 120 Hertz refresh rate. Now, I'll be honest, this is enabled right from the get-go. So uh, so you don't really need to re-enable it, but it will only apply in your home screen and supported applications. So it won't be enabled all the time or it won't function all the time. And for instance, right now, I'm pretty sure it shouldn't be enabled because I do have the extended battery mode, which does I'll run the headset at 75 hertz. So even though this is enabled, I'm pretty sure it's ignoring it. So if I can kind of spot the difference, you know, it's, uh, it's the same. So yeah, it's uh, even when it's enabled, it's still running at 75 hertz uh, based on the power saving mode. Uh, so those are the two ways. And obviously, if you're using something like virtual desktop as an example, or uh, the uh, Link Air, I think it is called, then those two uh, programs will have its own refresh rates, refresh rates that you can choose onto the headset. Uh, but that's for another video. So anyway, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.